So now we're going to talk about using your IllumiVet with the light therapy uh, books. So these are the books that we authored. We have light therapy for horses, light therapy for dogs, and, and they are mainly based on acupuncture points and meridians, but there are also some fascial release points in there as well. And so we get asked this quite often because within our books, we have a protocol section highlighted in blue, and we talk about uh, the color red, the color blue, and the color green. This device has red and near infrared in it. So what you're going to do, if you're going to be following along with our books, you're going to follow the protocol for red. And it's going to be exactly the same as what's in the book for red. Just follow the protocol for red and you'll be absolutely fine. And what you're going to do is, because our IllumiVet has no GA frequencies built in there, there is a way that you can illuminate the acupoints without any Nogier frequencies. And this is how we recommend that you start because Nogier frequencies, there's specific to um, certain parts of the body. And when I say certain parts of the body, what I mean is like it could be skin, it could be organ, it could be tendon, it could be ligament, it could be muscle, it could be bone. So because we're going through it from an acupuncture perspective and through the meridian energy perspective, we don't need necessarily need to use the Nogier frequencies. So I want to show you how to access that on your device. So you're going to turn your device on, you're going to hold it down, and then you're going to put your time on, and then you're going to hit start. And I'm going to be, nope, I'm putting this towards the camera for a reason because I want you to see that it is just straight red. If it had a Nogier frequency running on it, then you would see pulsing. It would be like showing like a very fast on off or it'd be showing a wave. Um, so for the acupuncture points, you want to start out using it without any Nogier frequencies on there and then just move along. The books do show you where to put the device and because this does cover a, quite a large area, you don't have to be really accurate. So don't get hung up on if you're in the right place because if you're, if you're within four inches, you're close enough. Um, you're going to get some really good results with it. So that's how you would utilize your IllumiVet with the um, light therapy books. If you are treating like a tendon ligament issue and it's not responding as well as you would like um, without the Nogier frequencies on, you can then go ahead and you can incorporate that. But if you're going at it strictly from an acupuncture perspective with the intent of doing acupuncture points, the intent of opening up those energy meridians, then it is not necessary to utilize those Nogier frequencies. I always encourage you to put red on immediately because it can actually prevent the body from experiencing cellular death. And if cellular death is there, then it'll actually just transport that uh, dead cell out of there quickly and cr encourage a uh, quicker turnover. So that is one of the super cool things that red does. 